Welcome back, Ohana, or if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Thomas, and this is Stitches Ohana. Well, it has been quite a while since I've posted a full video. Because I haven't been filming the last couple weeks outside of some shorts, um, and this upcoming week is my birthday week, I decided I've accumulated so many things, let's do a full week, Monday through Friday, a video a day, okay? So we have Pin Mail Monday, we have Circa 1955 Candles Tuesday, we have Wishable Wednesday, we have my birthday gift uh, haul on Thursday, and then on Friday we have my Funkos that I've got coming for the past few weeks. So it's gonna be a fun week. I hope you really enjoy everything. But like I said, today is Pin Mail Monday. Um, I don't have any pin mail necessarily, um, like traders or stuff like that, but I do have a haul of fig pins. Now fig pins are something I've just started getting into. Uh, I've seen them on other channels. I, I really like them but never really wanted to collect them until I started seeing the variety that they're starting to create, you know? So I have got in front of me some of the fig pins that Cameron and I have purchased for each other over the last month, okay? So let's just go ahead and get into it. Uh, the first ones I wanna show you are, let's see how this looks with the glare. It's in, it's plastic. But this is a fig pin. They are fairly big pins. Let's see if we can get it to focus. They're fairly big pins, really well detailed. Um, fairly thick too, you can see there. And this is Wally. Looking super cute and nervous. Um, and the cool thing about fig pins is they have, each one has its own specific engraved code on the back of it, um, right about here on the actual pin. So when you get this, you're able to link it to a fig pin account that you create off the app, and then you get points, and they're starting to create like a battleground on the fig pin app, and it's really cool. So, you know, it's really interesting to unlock these, see, you know, what edition they are, what number in the um, series it is and everything like that, and then just see, you know, what points they're worth. Um, I think that's what really has been capturing my attention for these, is just that interactive element, and then I can't wait for the battle portion of the app to come alive, so, you know, you can battle with other fig pin owners and stuff. So, we have Wally, and then we have Eva. There's, you know, she's more of a basic looking pin, but you can see the shadowing detail. You know, I just love Wally in general. Great movie and great additions to the collection. Okay, next, uh, let's see. Let's go to this series, which is uh, Kingdom Hearts. You all know I love Kingdom Hearts. So first off, we have Goofy. Now, Goofy is uh, the King's Guard. He is the lead guard, and there he is. Such, such a great-hearted character. We have the mage, Donald. Love Donald, that's my favorite character of the Fab Five, so I had to make sure I had him. We have King Mickey, looking kind of shy for a king, but there he is love the outfits. Like I said, Kingdom Hearts is like a mix between Disney and Final Fantasy. So you get a lot of that like gameplay mode and I just love it. And then finally the main character, Sora. Sora is the main character. Now he's not a Disney character per se. He's not necessarily part of the Final Fantasy team either. He is his own character from the Kingdom Hearts series. Love, love, love Sora. Okay, next, uh, these were some that I bought myself. I saw they were new on the Fig Pin website and they're limited edition, so I wanted to make sure I got them because I noticed their limited edition pins go fairly fast. So, we have Vision in his Halloween outfit in the black and white, and this is the cartoony look. 
when they're like the uh, I Dream of Genie. Okay, gonna focus, there it is. And then we have Wanda. Again, black and white in the Dream of Genie cartoon look. Let's see, focus. There she goes. So I really liked this. I loved WandaVision as a show. Um, I wasn't collecting the pops of them because I don't really like bobblehead pops too much. Um, but when I saw these as the limited edition, I had to get them. They also have the open edition, which is them in their color form. Um, I haven't purchased those yet because those are much easier to get just on a day-to-day -day thing. The LEs really tend to go fast. So I got those. And I should, I should mention to you, these were purchased via the Figpin website or the Mercari app. Okay, so Mercari is like an eBay, you know, personal seller kind of thing. Um, some of these just weren't available on Figpin anymore. Um, so we got some really good deals off Mercari. People were selling them. Really good condition. We have had nothing but successful sales and purchases from Mercari with Figpins and stuff. So... Um, if you ever, you know, want to check out Mercari, I highly recommend them because they've got some good deals there. Okay, so next up, we have the last that are my pins, okay? And as you know, I'm also a Harry Potter fan, so I had to go for the Harry Potter ones. So first up, we have Ron Weasley. I truly love the detail of these fig pins. They are so, so good. You get better at remembering which direction to go. <laughs> Next, we have Hermione Granger. Let's see if we can get a little closer so you can see her better. Again, just the detail for these is just so phenomenal. I just, I, I truly love these. And then finally, of course, Mr. Potter, Mr. Harry Potter. So there you go. So those are my pins, okay? And of course, Cameron, Cameron is never left behind in when I purchase things. He always gets something. Most of his stuff we don't show on the, the channel, but these I think are really cool and special and um, I do have people asking me, you know, what kind of stuff Cameron likes, what is he into as far as the Disney world, is he like Disney, Star Wars, Marvel, etc. So, so these are his fig pins. Now some of these he's bought himself and most of these I have bought for him, okay? So he's got five. He is big into X-Men. Marvel, not so much the full, you know, uh, universe, but X-Men, he truly loves X-Men, especially the old 90s cartoons, okay? So first up, we have Gambit. Now, Gambit is one of my favorite X-Men. I just love his um, New Orleans accent. I love that he has the playing cards. He's sarcastic, he's witty. He is cute, so I love Gambit, so I got that one for him, okay? Next up, I got him Jubilee. Jubilee is one of his favorite characters, loves Jubilee. Now the cool thing about Jubilee is Jubilee is available on the Figpin website, but they also have a limited edition version, which is Jubilee like Diamond Edition, right? which is this one. So you can see she's kind of like sparkly. Let me bring up side by side so you can see. So you can see there's a difference right there, right? The one on the left right here is all sparkly, keep drifting. And the one on the right is not. So this is the diamond edition one. This is an LE. This was not available on the website anymore, but on Mercari, I found the two pack for a really good deal. Um, basically at cost that you would pay on fig pets. So I was pretty surprised about that. Um, and the cool thing is, is these were not registered on Figpin yet. So they get to be in our account. So that was really cool. And just like the Jubilee, this is his favorite, but I also got him a two pack of Storm. So this is Storm Normal, 
This is his absolute favorite X-Men. And this is Storm Diamond Edition. Let's see if we can see. Let's see. This one's not as obvious. You can see it a little bit. But this one's not as obvious compared to the Jubilee. The Jubilee is really sparkly. Um, and I think it's because there's color in her outfit. So those are all the fig pins we have so far. Now, I know for my birthday, Cameron got me some fig pins because he told me, stop buying fig pins, don't buy anything because you might be getting some for your birthday. Um, I've already opened my presents. I already know it was kind of a, since you've been sick from the COVID shot, get your presents now. You know, my main present's gonna be Universal Studios later this week, um, so, I got to open my thing. So I already know what I got. I can't wait to show with share with you guys. So I have those ones to show off. And then I've also, now that I know what he bought me, I've already bought another handful that I'll be showing you again. Okay? So I really hope you enjoy this. Again, fig pin, your your quality, your detail is awesome. I'm loving these pins. I'm obsessed with them. And I've got like seven more on order right now. They're on their way. I can't wait to get them because they're more different fandoms, okay? So I really hope you enjoyed this first video of my birthday week extravaganza. Um, if you did like this video, please make sure you get a big thumbs up and leave me a comment letting me know, are you collecting big pins yourself? I'd love to know what series you have, you know, which ones do you got? Also, please consider subscribing to my channel. Make sure you hit that bell notification so you can be notified when I upload more content just like this. I would love to have you join the Ohana. And don't forget, I still have an open giveaway, my birthday giveaway video. I'll make sure that link is below and above so you can check it out. Um, it's still open. It closes on my birthday, Thursday, May 20th, okay? That's when it closes and the winner will be announced on the 24th, that following Monday. So make sure you got plenty of time still, you got the rest of this week to enter, okay? Until next time, which will be tomorrow, have a great rest of your day. I will see you tomorrow. And always, always, always remember that we are Ohana, and Ohana means family.